Let's pay a visit to the kangaroo family. Mr. Pig, what a surprise! Kylie, look who's come to visit! Hello, Peppa! Hello, George! Hello, Kylie! We were just passing by and thought we'd come and say hello. Ace, well, why don't we show you around some of our favourite places? Yes, yes! We could drive the minivan to the beach and visit the Great Barrier Reef. Or we could fly the plane to the outback for a very special picnic. There's so much to see in Australia. Which one would you like to do? Alrighty then, we'll take the plane to the outback for a picnic. All aboard! Everybody ready? Yes! yes. Then let's go! <laughs> it's time to fly. You can go up and down or make the plane go faster. Although the Outback is also a special, magical place for us. Flying in an aeroplane on a sunny day Going to a picnic a long, long way away Going to the Outback on a sunny day Flying to the Outback a long, long way away <laughs> <laughs> Right. I'm going to start preparing the barbecue for our lunch. Why don't you have a play in the outback? We can practice throwing my boomerang. Or we can play a spot of cricket. And keep your eyes peeled for koala bears. What would you like to do? Boomerang. It comes back when you throw it. Give it a go. Hold the boomerang for a moment, then throw it. The longer you hold it, the further it will go. Let's try playing cricket! it when you're ready to hit the ball. The ball has landed in a tree! Can you see the ball, Pepper? A teddy bear has got it. That's not a teddy bear. It's a koala bear. 
Hooray! We found one. Squeak! Radio, everyone. Lunch is ready. on the cob. Mmm, what a yummy, scrummy picnic. When we have a picnic, Mrs Duck always comes. <laughs> There's no chance of Mrs Duck showing up in the middle of the desert. <coughs> oh, oh. Mrs. Duckbill Platypus always shows up when we're having picnics. Corn on the cob for everyone. That was delicious. Mrs. Duckbill Platypus thinks so too. Okay, everyone. It's home time. Back on the plane. Home sweet home. What a fantastic trip to the outback. I love the outback. Um, what is it again? <laughs> <laughs> Alright everyone, into the minivan. We're going to see something amazing at the beach. Away! The beach is just up ahead. Drive the minivan to move forward. <laughs> There's incredible wildlife on the seabed, and it's my job to take care of it. When you're ready, hop inside the submarine and we'll explore the ocean. The Great Barrier Reef. It's made up of coral that goes for miles and miles. It's up to me to keep it safe. Can we take some coral home with us? Sorry, Pepper. We can look, but we mustn't touch. The submarine can move in any direction you want. Why don't you try driving it? If you find something interesting, you can pick it up with the grabbing claws. <laughs> Let's see if we can pick it up with the claws. 
But you said we shouldn't touch anything. We meant you mustn't touch anything that belongs here. But gold coins don't belong in the ocean. And we can use them to pay for lots more marine research. We got the treasure! Hooray! Now, let's get it back to the minivan. Water in the submarine. And we learnt so much about the importance of keeping coral safe. I'm glad you all had fun. My, my. Is that the time? I'm afraid we need to carry on with our trip. Ah, oh, So soon? I'm afraid so. Lots to see. But thank you so much for showing us around. I had a brilliant time! Come back soon! Mummy, can we have a great berry reef in our garden? Oh, I don't think so, Peppa. We don't have our own submarine. <laughs> Good job. You've learned many things about Australia and found a lost treasure. It's been lots of fun. <laughs> <laughs>